Hey guys, it's me again. Um, today I wanted to do a review video um, on some false eyelashes I purchased that I really love and I'm a little bit frustrated right now because um, I don't know who of you out there own fake glasses. Um, I grew up not needing glasses while the rest of my family, like we would all go to the eye doctor together and my brother and sister would both get like new glasses and I never got glasses and I always wanted glasses so I got myself some glasses but if you've ever owned fake glasses you'll know that they're not like real glasses where they don't have like they have like non glare blah 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 lenses because they're all fake and plastic and glass and who even knows if it's real glass so right now there's a horrible glare coming off of my face towards your face and I'm sure it's not pleasant so I will be taking these off <laughs> for the remainder of the video but it's very frustrating because I was in a glasses mood today and I got all dressed in my glasses and I can't even wear them for my video. So, it's a little upsetting. But now I'm going to get down to the point of the video, which is my new false eyelashes. Um, some of them I have worn already, so you might be able to see that. Um, the company is called Kiss. Um, and I haven't, been, I've only been able ever to find these in like um, really random like little beauty supply stores in New York. So, I don't know if they have them anywhere else. I've looked online and they have a website where you can, like, locate stores to buy them in. But for some reason, you can't buy them on the website. Um, and Amazon, I looked on Amazon, and Amazon has, like, one or two pairs. But they have so many beautiful different ones that, like, why limit yourself to that? So, if you can go to the website, I'll put it in the down bar below. If you can go to the website um, and find out, like, a store near you that has them, I think you should totally do it. They're not extremely expensive, which I think is great for um, for false eyelashes because, you know, you wear them a few times and then it's like you can't wear them again after, you, I mean, you can only wear them so many times before they kind of like start looking kind of ratty and, you know, you can only take care of them so well. So, um, so anyway, so I'm going to show you one of the boxes. Well, I'm going to show you all of them. They're all still in their boxes because I put them back in to like keep them. Um, so basically this is what the company box looks like. It, the company is, it's called I Envy by Kiss. Um, some of them are made with human, with like Remy hair, human hair. It says it right here, premium human hair. And some of them just say premium. Um, so I guess some of them are human hair, some of them aren't. But they're all really beautiful. Um, and personally I don't think there's a difference. So... That's just me. Um, I'll show you the pairs that I have. Oh, sorry. That's my phone vibrating. I'll show you the pairs that I have. Um, I've worn three of them so far. I was really happy with them. Um, so, yeah. So let's get down to business. Oh, I paid $3.99 for each of them plus tax. Um, so, yeah. I mean, I've, I've gotten them once before and not from this place, and I think they were around the same price. So, it's probably, like, the same as, like, Ardell lashes, but I think they have much more variety and... Like, Ardell lashes don't really impress me that much. Like, they're hard. Sometimes they're really hard for me to get on my eyes, but these are really easy to get on. Um, and, yeah. So, I'm going to show you the ones that I have. Um, so this one is called Beyond Natural 01. So there's, like, different lines. There's, like, accent ones. There's the Diva line. There's the All Natural line. There's, like, all different kinds. So this one is the Beyond Natural ones. Um, and it's KPE 33. And they're just, like... They're like pretty thick and wispy. And then they have these tiny little ones that come out a little bit a little bit longer than the rest of the lashes, if you can see that. And they're like, it just your lashes just look like really full and long and like just like gorgeous. But they're not like so extreme. I mean they're like they're extreme. Don't get me wrong, they're extreme and like they're way more pretty than my natural lashes, but they're not so extreme that like you would look at me and be like, oh, those are fake lashes. You know, like you might, unless you have like a really good trained eye, in which case, don't judge me. But, um, yeah, so the next, the next ones, these I've also worn before, so like it's kind of dirty in the box. You can see like where the mascara is running off of it, and there's still some glue left on it. But these are Divas, and it's Diva, sorry, it's Diva KPE 21S. And these were also really nice. The, the ones that go all the way across your eyes, um, that are like full lashes, I usually have to cut off a little bit of this, of like the inner corner of it, because my eyelids are just, I mean, I'm a small person, so my eyelids are kind of small, um, so, they're, they're, I mean, they're made pretty long, most people cut off some of it, um, also I find that 
the closer it is to the inner corner of my eye, the more likely it is to like start to come, like the glue to come unstuck throughout the night or day or whatever. So I usually try and make it so they only come in until about here to like where your pupil would be, like the middle, yeah, okay, if that makes sense. Um, because then it, it sticks better there than it would like closer to the inner corner where like my eyes tear up more. Um, so then there's two more pairs that I got. Th these I haven't worn yet, um, but I'll tell you why I really like them. These are called On Natural. These are from the On Natural line, and they're KPE09. And these I really like because they're like full, but not like thick, thick, thick full like spiders. <laughs> and they kind of I don't know if you can see that, but they they're skinnier on the inside and they flare out towards the end. I love lashes. Like I don't like the ones that that are, well, with the exception of the first ones I showed you, I generally don't like the ones that are like the same length all the way across the eye. I like the ones that start out like shorter in the middle and get really long towards the end and kind of like, I don't know, I don't know how to explain it, like kind of like flare out at the ends and like they just make a really nice like cat eye shape, which is obviously the look I go for because <laughs> I always wear cat, like, like the cat eye eyeliner. So I really like when my when my eyelashes are like really long and wispy at the end because it makes them really pretty. So I really like that pair. And then the other, the last pair that I got are accent lashes, and I wore these and they are, they are like to die for. Like I am obsessed with this pair, and I almost don't want to wear them unless it's like really really special because I don't want to waste them if that makes any sense. Um, so these are KPE forty on the Kiss website. These are the only accents that they make. So I I think. I mean, I'm assuming that's because they are the only accent that they make, um, but they might make other ones that, like, I just haven't seen, but they're, like, so gorgeous, and they look really thick and, like, kind of spidery and crazy, but, like, they just go on the very outer corner of your eye, and if you can put them really close so that they, like, really blend in, it's just so beautiful. Like, they just, like, kind of, like, flare out at the edges. It's so gorgeous. Um, I really like all these. They wear really well. So far, the ones that I've worn once have worn pretty well, except for the one pair that I kind of, I abused. The one, the dirty ones, like, I, I kind of abused these. Um, so, yeah, but that was my own fault. But generally, if you take them off, if you don't sleep in them, if you take them off before you go to sleep, um, and you kind of, like, pull off all the glue from the edges, um, they, I mean, generally they can last, like, two or three wears, for me anyway. Um... Yeah, I just, like, you should, I'll, I'll put the, the website in the down bar. You should look at all of them. They make, like, really beautiful ones, like, ones I haven't even seen Ardell make before. Um, ones that I would almost think were, like, um, worthy of, like, Makeup Forever or, like, ones you would find at Ricky's, but much cheaper and a little less dramatic and extreme. So... That's my eyelash haul slash review. Um, let me know what you think. Let me know if you can find a website. Sorry, my phone's going crazy. Let me know if you can find a website that has them for sale because I haven't been able to, um, and I'm usually pretty good at Google searching. And my nose ring's sticking out a little bit. I'm usually pretty good at Google searching, so if you can find one, um, let me know. Let me know if you've used these before. Let me know if you have found better, cheaper, prettier lashes. Um, I like playing around with false lashes. I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to stop talking now because you're probably bored of me by now. So rate, comment, request, subscribe, and I'll see you on YouTube. Bye.